Yeah. Shout out to my boy Glory D. You know what I mean? Spit all DVD. All you just want to do is battle. That's all you niggas think about. I ain't trying to be the best battle rapper. For me not to try to be the best battle rapper and to be in everybody's top five, you do the math for that. And I was, I'm was i not trying to be the best battle rapper. It's niggas that try to, they, they want to be the best battle rapper. And we in the same category. So hold on. What, what inspired you to start rapping? Real talk. You probably, I don't never hear no interviews ask you that, so I'm gonna, I don't even know, like, what inspired you to start rapping? My niggas did. Yeah. And my son, Paul. Yeah, he used to hear us in the staircase going crazy. Mm -hmm. Back, so back in the day. I guess he decided to pick up a pen, you know what I mean? Do what he do. Back in the day, long time ago. I used to be in the stair, in the stair, cause they was calling it the cave. Yeah, the stair, the stair cave. My son Bob used to make the, the beat with some keys and his hands on the door. And they used to be going in. Word, and one day I just, I just fucking, um, I said, y'all got a rap. Niggas thought I was lying. <laughs> went there and spit some shit. I was writing that shit for mad long. <laughs> Word, but. So what advice you would have? What advice would you have for like these young yeah. cats trying to get into the battlefield? Because yeah. you're a pioneer at that. When you I say mean, that, you know what? If that's what you want to do, just go hard at it. Um, by, by, like, by, like, whatever you want to do, just go hard at it. Well, There's so. a lot of outlets now. It's not like when I was coming up. It wasn't that much cameras and all that. All this shit wasn't happening on camera. There wasn't no battle on cameras. It was just your man talking shit to another nigga, man. And they talk about they man is the nicest. And y'all y'all just meet up one day and y'all battle. You know what I'm saying? Not even. It's, it's, it's unexpected. You might be walking down a block and, and they, it's a nigga cypher. Might call you out. And nigga might just call you out. Or you might, or you might just be in a cypher. Nigga just start spitting at you. Yeah. It wasn't this, this um, put together three months to write for a nigga shit. So right now it's a, it's a little easier, but it's a lot of outlets. You got Shit Smack, you, right you know, so you got the URL, you got Grind Time, you Shit got wrestling. King of the Ring. Like you got a lot of outlets. You got Glory D. You got a lot of cameras that's out there that is, is filming niggas and showing their talent. So it's easy for somebody to get picked up and get in, get in that arena if that's what they want to do. You just gotta make it known that's what you want to do and do it. That's all. Well, okay, shout out to my boy Paul Lee too, man. He's young, he's up and coming. Oh, yeah. My son, yeah. my son, Mike's that's little my brother. Son, that's my son, Mike's little brother. That's my yeah, little brother. Paul, Paul, got some shit. Yeah. Well, GMB is definitely the movement right now. GMB here, too. Oh, that's man, what it boss. is. So, Call I made, and, I, and I did that because I'm tired of hearing these niggas, like, this preschool shit. These niggas be spending a lot of preschool shit, like, it, it be like real simple shit, and niggas be liking it. And it should be, the, cause the ever I'm from, you couldn't spit that at all. Like, right. you could not spit that shit. Like a nigga, you wouldn't, you know, like you had to be nice. Coming up in the era I come, you had to be nice. You had to be saying something, something with some substance. So the grown man boss is just basically trying to bring it back to where a nigga gotta be saying something. But if you saying these ABC shit that a nigga can't feel, you know what I'm saying? Give me an example of one of the grown man boss, like. You know what I'm saying? Something that's, you know, that you, that you said. Got shit already? Yes. Yeah, something you said. Something. Somehow. A couple verses. Um, I just got, I just got in from playing the round six. I should have been laying with my bitch. Instead, Instead I, was I was laying with some, some bitch. bitch. So, so I creeped in. I hope you sleep in. Went straight, went straight to the bathroom. To the bathroom. I, didn't I didn't want, want to, to, but I had to. Dwelling on what occurred. My body got stench. I'm smelling like her. Gotta I gotta clean her. my dick. Gotta clean 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 my dick. I'ma go straight to the bed, lay down and cover up. Knowing I bust a nut, I hope she don't want fuck. Why well, I keep doing this? Instead of doing good, when I got something good, I gotta ruin shit. It's like going from tilapia to tuna fish. Like that, that that's real shit. A, a nigga could relate to that. Yeah, you know cool. what I'm saying? Because that shit I, I didn't went through. You know what I'm saying? And it, it, it's, it's a bunch of niggas out there that got a good shit. Yeah, hey, nigga, a hey, nigga. I mean, if you if you got a, if you doing if you doing you, if you fucking with joints, man. 
You can relate to that, man. Like, that's real shit, man. Nah, Ain't yeah, nigga yeah, got to slide. Shit. Not me, though. Got a I wife. love my lady, though. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, man. I love my lady personally. Yeah, yeah. I mean, anybody got shit, a wife, though. anybody got a slide. Real nigga so, shit, though. Man. But just stay though. You can relate to that, man. Glory Shout out D. to my boy, Glory D. You know what I mean? Spit all DVD. 